My name is Frank Shamrock, world champion fighter, martial artist, warrior. My professional journey took me to the very top of the fighting world, but that success came at a high price. I've left a lot of damaged relationships in my wake. Now, I'm 40 years old. And I've come to that place in my life where I'm ready to confront the past. The Warrior's Code says that's the only way to find peace. So to move forward on my journey, I'm traveling backwards and telling my story in a way it's never been told before. My goal was to be the greatest fighter in the world. When you look at the pantheon of the greatest mixed martial artists, you should begin with Frank Shamrock. He was the best fighter at his weight class. There was no one that was better. Five-time UFC champion. He was one of the first guys who really had the whole package. The greatest mixed martial artist of the 90s. He was the best fighter of the decade. Frank is a fighter. Never got tired. Aggressive. Technical. Different species. He was ahead of his time. In my opinion, he was the first complete fighter in MMA. He could wrestle, he could submit you, and he could strike with you. No one had really done that before in the way that Frank Shamrock had. Everybody else was a kickboxer, they were a wrestler, the jiu-jitsu guy. He was the guy who went out and did everything. I love Frank like a brother. I mean, he's one of my favorite people in the world. He was a good role model for a lot of these kids coming up from the street. Frank is a pioneer. Frank is somebody who has been laying down the runway for, for guys like me to take off. When you look at Frank Shamrock and know where he's come from and what he has had to overcome, martial arts saved his life. First person who taught me about martial arts was my foster brother, Ken Shamrock. But we haven't spoken in over 15 years. I felt he disrespected me, so I split from him and my father. Ken never forgave me for that. And now, in order to find peace, I know I need to talk to Ken, face to face. And knowing Ken, anything could happen. I'm not sure why Frank's doing this. There's a lot of stuff underneath the sea, a lot of bad things happening under there. Frank needs something. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's selfish. I don't know if it's for his career, or maybe he needs closure. I don't know, but I, I sense something different. So we'll see what it is. Facing Ken, the pain of what happened between us won't be easy. But I've been dealing with pain since long before I knew Ken, since I was a young boy named Frank Juarez. Frank Shamrock, Bound by Blood, Thursday, October 10th at 11 on Spike.